Hello everyone, this is Moshe, the electric Israeli. Welcome to my channel. Please subscribe, help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all my supporters and especially my Patreons who help this channel keep going. Uh, today we're going to talk about uh, the essential question is the Tesla Model 3 base, the $35,000 is going to be discontinued according to uh, Elon Musk and Tesla. The answer is no. Uh, probably you know that it was on the uh, website at the very beginning when it was launched uh, a couple months ago and then quietly disappeared and you can order it by 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 you can you can do it by phone or if you go to the store to the tesla store and then the guy there or the gal there can do it with you uh you will be encouraged to upgrade to the uh the model s uh the model s base plus which has a 240 miles uh looks like it is probably the most a uh, popular tesla model s base kind of a thing before you go to the higher level so uh looks like at the beginning i thought that it was taking out from the website because there were so many orders that they couldn't keep up then uh, uh, now they say that there are very little orders there are, there is no interest just for reference so you know back in the day 2012 uh before tesla sold even one car Tesla was talking about um, a Tesla Model S 40 kilowatt hour, 160 miles back in the day when 160 miles was a lot of electric miles. That car was never produced and never sold because nobody wanted it. I tell you, as a um, electric car owner, you know, I, I had the Nissan Leaf with 80 miles and I drove it for three and a half years for 40,000 miles and it was just fine. But once you get the taste of range, and you have um, uh, cars that are affordable, like let's say the Kona EV, which has 258 miles, or all the other brands that have 200 miles plus. Once you have, let's let's say you have you have a Tesla Model 3 base for 220 miles, and that let's say 35,000, and then for 39,500 you can get the the base plus for 240 miles and autopilot and all that stuff. People make that jump. People make that leap. I go to Tesla Center often, and I have guys there who have Tesla Model S performance, knowing that they're going to buy whatever it is, the, the rear wheel like I have, the rear wheel drive. And then they immediately, you know, you get the taste, you get tempted, and you want the best. And you absolutely want the best. So I am not surprised that there is not too much demand. Um, you know, when somebody gets to those numbers 35 and up you are going to go for the range and for maybe autopilot or color that you like or whatever it is that you want and that's natural so i am not uh, uh, surprised that um uh, it's uh, there is no much demand and i will not be surprised if it will take it out i think it's wise to keep it on uh, I think the, the uh, version in China that's going to be sold will be produced as the base because the economics there are different. For example, the Model Y, the future Model Y, you have uh, the 300 mile and the 280 miles. There is a base version for, I believe, 240. It's not on the website. And I will not be surprised that it will never produce. Never be produced. Never. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you are in the market for, let's say, a base Mal S, Mal A3, a would you like go for it and do the next level to get more miles in autopilot? Let me know what you think. If you are in the market for a Tesla anyway, please use my link. Thank you for your, for your support. You can get a lot of free miles. Consider uh, becoming a patron for this awesome channel. I'll see you tomorrow. Help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thanks, guys.